What's up everybody? This is me, Otaku Guru, and here I am. Yes, here I am because we have today face reveal. So, what this mean? Why are you doing face reveal? Why now? And is that mean that we gonna find your face more often? Yes, you gonna find me more often on YouTube, probably in the future on Twitch, because still I have a plan for this platform. But before that, YouTube and social media. Yeah. So yes, we have today a special edition. Let's see episode. I'm wearing special edition t-shirt. And also, I would like to use this uh, opportunity to answer to some of your questions I received under a few of my YouTube videos, uh, with the video related to the face reveal, and on social media, and some of you even asked me uh, via direct messages. So, all of this will happen today. Okay, so, uh, first let me sh tell you a few things. Uh, I'm doing face reveal uh, because I would like to build a better connection with everyone who's watching my videos, with all of you, uh, because uh, I'm planning to make my channel better, uh, trying to answer your questions, trying to solve some of your issues if you have any, and would you like to know something about not only just the Pokemon, but as well about the games. Uh, Manga and anime, because you know, uh, I be doing and I will be doing uh, some videos related uh, to anime and manga, not only uh, Pokemon. So hope you're gonna understand that one, because I have a lot of great stuff to show you, to tell you, to do with you, like playing some games. Uh, show gameplays, make reviews and everything like that. Okay, so uh, before that, actually, before I started recording these videos, some great package showed up today. Yes, we have Pokemon SM11 Miracle Twin Booster Box. Definitely, I'll be opening this one on my channel soon. Uh, don't know what day, but please wait for that one. I have also something more. I've been waiting for it. And this is this great art book, art collection. And this one in, well, includes a special Charizard promotional card. Yes, I'm going to grade it. I want that. And at end of this video, I'm going to open this Amazon par package, sorry, not parcel because it isn't a big one, but something like a week uh, or maybe about two weeks ago, and I've got something from my wish list, and still I don't know who was that kind to send me something, <laughs> and really this made my day, you know, and I was close to tear up this packing, you know, and find out, but who knows, it's been something, oh, I know, okay, I've tried to look inside, but I couldn't find this, I know there is some sort of the box, but not sure what is that, so we're gonna find it at the end of this video, and now, let's go and move to quick Q&A, some questions you ask me, okay, so, uh, first one, what's your favorite Japanese set? Ooh, difficult, but I think so. I'm gonna to say this is gonna be Tag Bolt uh, SM9 because this is the first time new Tag Team GX uh, been featured in Pokemon TCG. As well, uh, of course, this set's featuring one of my favorite Pokemon, which is Pikachu. Of course, we have a Pikachu and Zekrom, but this card looks amazing, really. Uh, you know how I like Pikachu, probably. If not, so now we have the opportunity, even this body. <laughs> when did you start collecting Pokemon cards? Uh, actually, I start years ago, when I was a kid. Uh, 
but I had to drop this one. I dropped it because I haven't got enough money uh, for Pokemon TCG. Uh, also, uh, somehow, I, I don't know the other reason, I just stopped, you know. I was just a kid, I had the base set, a few actually very good cards and, and I decided to came back uh, something about 2016 I believe, about 16, 17 I won some cards and I always like Pokemon, I've been playing Pokemon uh, game, uh, I've been playing sometimes, occasionally, CG uh, online and when I won the cards it made me like, because that was the XY era, um, made me come back, you know, and I'm very grateful because I not only start uh, again collecting the English cards but also I start collecting the Japanese cards too because they look really amazing. Who's your favorite YouTuber? Wow, this is a really difficult question, you know. Uh, I don't have any favorite YouTuber. I thought I had when I came back to Pokemon TCG collecting, uh, but I don't have anyone very specific. Of course, I really like, example, the primetime Pokemon uh, openings. Uh, these openings are calm and nice. Uh, I remember I've been watching Canalista Tlip as well. Uh, sometimes it, it made me annoyed by his screaming, you know. Uh, I've watched PokéSoup as well because he's been playing a lot of vintage and I really love this. I like uh, vintage Pokémon cards. Uh, that's why I'm collecting them as well and trying to collect uh, some sealed packs and boxes things, everything what I can actually try and get for some really good price, you know, because this stuff is right now very expensive and not only English but the Japanese too. Uh, why Otaku Guru and not something like Poke Guru? Uh, okay, let me start from the uh, end of this question. Uh, Poke Guru, if I remember, exists. Uh, Otaku Guru, I think so, I found as well someone uh, similar, uh, but I've been running uh, on some social medias, uh, my name Otaku Guru, I believe, earlier um, than the other one, not sure right now, uh, but I've been running my website as Otaku Guru a little bit longer, that was actually just a blog back then, right now, if you know, I have as well the proper website otakuguru.com where you can find some information about Pokemon, anime, manga and games console. And this is actually why Otaku Guru, because I'm kind of otaku. I'm not just the Pokemon guy, I've been otaku for years, since, since I started my journey uh, as a kid. Uh, Pokemon wasn't the first one, I've been watching Captain Tsubasa, uh, Yataman and many other great anime back then, Sailor Moon of course as well, and this is why Otaku, what Otaku Guru, you know, <laughs> I'm Otaku. <laughs> uh, what's your favorite set? Uh, Okay, we had a question about the Japanese set and I said that was a tag bolt, but if you talk about the all sets, I think so, base set. I would say the base set because, because this is some sort of nostalgia, uh, you know, this is where everything started. I really like the old design, there's a lot of great cards. There's as well a lot of great artworks created back then by Mitsuhiro Arita. I really appreciate his work. Uh, and yeah, that would be base set, you know, definitely. I like your website, but any plans for some tutorials, guides and articles? Oh wow, thanks, uh, you know. <laughs> I really appreciate that. 
Uh, I've been talking about the website and I completely forgot about these questions even. I have all of them written in one doc, you know. <laughs> mm. Yes, definitely, definitely some tutorials, guides and the articles. I'm working right now on few articles at the same time, you know. Uh, I had some difficult time uh, recently and it, not everything went according to my plan. But I'm moving with everything slowly. I also, you know, I'm cooperating with some brands, uh, PR staff and other staff. So I'm getting a lot of information and the details. I'm trying to be in touch with everyone I can. I'm trying to get the new contacts. I'm planning, planning a lot of stuff. Uh, I've trying to do like uh, Pokemon Let's Go gameplays, but there's a lot of people who's doing that one and I've stopped these videos, uh, but I've decided to do some stuff uh, for website. Still haven't published uh, many of them. Uh, they are, you know, like in a progress and also I've tried to build something nice to show them and let people uh, to browse uh, through them because I I'm fan of the usability. Uh, so if user experience is good and people can find some information very easily and quickly about what they looking for. So even if we're talking about some game guides, that would be better to make this stuff uh, better, you know. Uh, in the proper way and then create all of this stuff but I know this one stuff is taking uh, some time so I need to move slowly and start doing them and then by time trying to fix them very quickly so you can expect this stuff uh, I cannot guarantee that will be uh, a lot of stuff example like uh, because someone asked me earlier um, related to Pokemon, like creating decks or something. I'm not that kind of uh, competitive player or someone. I'm more collector. I like to play occasionally, uh, but I try my best for that stuff. But I have a lot of knowledge about games console and even Pokemon games, you know, so I try to give you some stuff related to this. Okay, uh, I have a couple. Oh, wow, I forgot who writes this one. Uh, okay, what area are you located in? Not to get specific, <laughs> lol. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, I'm based in England, uh, Bristol, very nice city. Uh, yeah, nice green. We have even around today, very nice weather. Yesterday we had big rain. But I think it's cool, you know. I'm living in Bristol for some time. Have you picked uh, up any more vintage Pokemon recently and when do we get to see it? And also what's your favorite Pokemon? Okay, uh, vintage. Uh, vintage is expensive, you know. Uh, I don't remember what was uh, last one. Hmm. Oh jeez. This is a very tough question, you know. Uh, I've been having some things, some, uh, I have been having actually some uh, single cards, uh, the vintage cards, you know, but about some vintage sealed packs. Mm -hmm. If I remember, I've got some few back in February, or maybe that was the January Holland Phantoms, uh, very good from the trade. Uh, and then we're really happy. I'm going to even to open one of them uh, soon. Uh, I've got some... No, not, I haven't got that tin. That was too expensive. Oh, jeez. Oh, actually, I have one Japanese. I never posted this one on... This is under my desk. Uh, some from the Diamond and Pearl era. I've got uh, this sort of the blister pack with three booster packs and two uh, promotional cards. 
Magius and Electrode. So yeah, this is some sort of stuff I got recently. You know, um, something else? Not, not much. Uh, I've been getting a lot of recent stuff like Pokemon Detective Pikachu, uh, some uh, Pokemon Kunats. If you haven't seen them on my Twitter, on Instagram, and I'm going to open them. I cannot wait for that one. One extra box with some nice stuff. Uh, no one actually guessed what is it, but I'm going to open this one soon. This is of course some Sun and Moon stuff, so uh, nothing vintage, sorry. <laughs> when I get more vintage stuff, definitely you're gonna find them on social media and I try to make a more video suite uh stuff i've been buying so maybe it's a good time i can try and gather the stuff i never posted on any video and try to make one big video from all of my recent purchase uh, since let's say the january uh, 2019 so this year and what's your favorite pokemon uh my of course my favorite pokemon is a pikachu uh, but i'm also like Mew and Mewtwo, and I like Pikachu, Pikachu uh, looks like a nice body, I have a lot of Pikachu stuff, even behind me you can see Pikachu from the Burger King, I have Pikachu on my desk everywhere, example this, hello Pikachu, hello Pikachu, Pika Pika, Pikachu? <laughs> okay, buddy. Okay, okay, calm down. Take it easy, man. <laughs> uh, so yes, Pikachu is my favorite, and as I said, me and Mewtwo. So yeah, I have, you can say, three favorite Pokemon. Uh, what's oh what's your favorite Pokemon? <laughs> so that's the second uh, same question. Uh, as I told you, Pikachu. Let's keep Pikachu as the main because this is the main, you know. Uh, what are we doing with cards? Only collect them or play? Uh, as I told you earlier, uh, yes, I'm more collector uh, than the player. I'm trying play. Um, but this is just occasionally, and even if I'm attending some pre-release events, so I'm not some sort of you know, <laughs> great player there. I'm trying my best just for fun, and that's it. I'm doing this for fun. I wanted to play more, but sometimes this is because of the time. You know, I cannot do everything what I want, and that's always been related. Uh, to work uh, as well, life and plus what I like uh, to do, example with the website or uh, YouTube channel. And because if we talk about life, uh, I'm also a father, I have a wife and I have a very nice, lovely one year old boy. <laughs> okay, any plans for game streams, gameplays? Yes. Uh, streams, uh, definitely I need to put them uh, to my YouTube channel uh, uh, with some, you know, some schedule. So I need to make some schedule for this stuff. Um, definitely when Pokemon Sword and Shield will come, I'm planning a lot of content related to this one. I'm planning some gameplays and some sp uh, gameplays uh, to the anime related games uh, on Switch and other consoles like PlayStation 4, for example, and uh, uh, streams with the games like Smash and other where you can play with your friends, you can play online. I've been even streaming sometimes occasionally Mario Kart, because I like Mario Kart, this is one of the best game. I've been doing maybe just one time uh, Smash, but definitely I need to do more of them. I've seen your videos, uh, not only Pokemon related, 
what you're planning about them. Are you going to keep this uh, only Pokemon or going with manga, anime? Uh, yes, as I told you, this is not gonna be just a uh, Pokemon. I'm planning uh, stuff related with the manga and anime, so even if you're talking about uh, some figures, so because I like, for example, Nendoroid figures, so this is one of them on my desk. Uh, Holo from Spice and Wolf, if you're not favorite with this title. This is a very nice anime and I really recommend you that one. Uh, I have some petits as well from the other anime on my desk, shelf everywhere. I have some other gadgets, um, some Funko from the Dragon Ball, you know, there's there is a lot of stuff, not everything is on my desk and around me because I don't have that much space here. Uh, but I really want to show you some of them. Uh, sorry, I really want uh, to review them uh, for website, for YouTube and be able to share this one with you. Uh, I'm also expecting soon some as well new Nendoroid figures and I really would like to make some opening, show them display, you know, make this nice, <laughs> this nice review videos uh, for you guys. And of course, definitely the Pokemon stuff, uh, Pokemon TCG openings, uh, games uh, and stuff related with them. Uh, anime, so about the anime, uh, I've been thinking about some upcoming anime, maybe some reviews, maybe some previews or something, because there's a lot of great stuff coming. I am Bikotaku, I don't have maybe that much time as I used to have, uh, sorry, uh, to watch all of them uh, on a day they coming, but I'm trying my best all the time. Uh, but I really would like to share uh, some of this stuff with you. And also the games. Uh, I'm a gamer, uh, I'm a big Nintendo fan, so I really love Nintendo and I would like to share this stuff with you. So yes, this is the kind of the content you can expect. Okay, let's move to the next. <laughs> okay, quick break. And this isn't a sponsor of material, so you know. Yo, I haven't seen that one. <laughs> uh, okay, what was the next? Uh, games, uh, anime, manga. Okay, what's your favorite anime and manga? Uh, definitely Dragon Ball. Uh, I'm a big Dragon Ball fan. I love Dragon Ball. I spent my great time watching Dragon Ball and... This is why uh, Dragon Ball, even the manga, I really like it. And because we've got a Dragon Ball Super, uh, I've been really waiting for that one. And yes, I'm also uh, have a lot of other uh, anime, uh, which one comes, comes up uh, later, you know. So like My Hero Academia, where I prefer Boku no Hero Academia if you want to be more specific uh, because this is a very good anime and if you haven't seen it you should give it a try of course Pokemon uh, we have Tsubasa uh, Captain Tsubasa uh, but also the, if you talk about the Tsubasa uh, there was a very beautiful uh, nice beautiful anime about some journey uh, with a guy and she was a princess if I remember Mm, maybe. Sorry. Not the same memory. <laughs> Do you have any favorite Japanese singer? Oh yeah, definitely. I know maybe this is... It's not gonna be that uh, someone you not expect, but back then I really loved uh, listening to Ayumi Hamasaki. I know she's very popular, but I really like her music. Uh, there is also Kokia, uh, if I, I'm spelling her correctly, uh, her. Uh, she had a very nice music as well. Uh, and of course, Utada Hikaru, 
those three actually, I really love them. Uh, there was a lot of uh, pants. I don't remember all of them right now, uh, but I really love to listen to them. I really love Japanese music. Uh, it's different than Western and and uh, English Europe uh, music. So I've been listening a lot of Japanese music back in old years and still listening them, you know, all the time. Uh, what's your favorite game platform? Uh, as I said, Nintendo. I'm a big Nintendo fan. I'm also PlayStation fan, but PlayStation was just all the time for uh, best graphic uh, experience. Nintendo all the time was the best if we talk about joy uh, from uh, that's coming from the games and from the console, you know, you know what I'm talking about. This was something, and I really like uh, Nintendo. Uh, any favorite game type? Any specific game? Mm, I like platformers. I like shooters. I like puzzle games uh, where you have uh, think a little bit more. Uh, about the game and how you can actually play it, uh, how you can end the game, where you can spend a lot of time playing. I've also, example, like if we talk uh, the specific game, uh, the recent one is the Zelda Breath of the Wild. Uh, I really love this game. This is the first Zelda with the open world. This is masterpiece. This is really masterpiece. I like the platformers, like uh, the classic Mario, Super Mario Bros, uh, or even Mario Bros. Uh, 3, you know, and the new one as well. So this is the kind of the games, game types, and the games I really like and enjoy. Uh, yeah, I, I like as well the RPG. Uh, I really like RPG. You, of course, you need a lot of time for them, but I really enjoy them. Uh, okay, do you have any other hobbies? So, my hobbies basically are uh, Otaku World, uh, which is, I mean, manga, Pokemon, games, you know, but also I like uh, cycling, I like swimming. Uh, not doing this uh, mad a lot recently, uh, because the first year when you have a baby, sometimes uh, it's difficult for some people, and I'm not telling that was a very difficult, but this is a lot you have to adjust uh, to and compromise some stuff as well. But I really enjoyed it, you know, so don't think uh, at that example if I'm saying something wrong about it. No, that's, that's the best time as well in my life. So. That's, that's my hobbies um, and everything related with the IT because uh, example that was the next question I can see right now it's what you're doing for a living so I'm a web designer and basically around the user interface and the user experience around this stuff I also with some coding uh, front-end development other stuff so this is basically as well my hobbies because I been doing this for years and I enjoy them. I love this stuff. Uh, okay. Oh, two last questions. <laughs> okay. Sorry. Uh, how long have we been doing this one? Oh wow, that's a lot of time. Okay. Why Ferris reveal now and not later? Uh, I really wanted to change some things. So, so I, as I told you, build better connection with of you and I really wanted this stuff show my face show you expression when I'm pulling some good card uh, when I'm talking to you about even some art book or cards or feature so you can see what I'm truly feeling uh, what I would like to tell you about this and yeah that's it basically What's next with channel? 
still not sure but there is a lot of work and I told you my plans earlier everything uh, what I would like to achieve and do so there's nothing more a lot of hard work and I really would like to get more subscribers so if you truly feel that I'm worthy please subscribe and of course I would like to thank to everyone who's already subscribed to my channel and I hope you stay with me yes so wow uh, I thought I've been doing this one for less but we ended up with almost 30 minutes of the video so I think so it's time to stop it sorry maybe I'm going to open this one on a separate video uh, not in this one sorry about this I would like you to watch the whole video or even the scroll for some of the best moments and I'm not trying to bother uh, you make you know feel like oh yes how big is that video please stop talking no any future video will be less than that but right now you know i ended up with something long we had a lot of questions and i wanted to answer all of them to you so yes thank you guys for watching thank you for staying please subscribe please tell your friends and stay with me thank you See ya later.